Hello YouTube and welcome back to the blog. Uh, I'm not talking so much about weight loss today and because I think the blog is kind of transformed from weight loss into just me getting out and telling it about myself and showing the things I'm doing. And I, I want to be consistently uploading videos and showing things. So this, this I took some footage at Art Battle, which happened in our local area. And I, I thought it was a pretty neat thing. And if you do have an opportunity to attend an art battle, I, I, I really recommend it. It was a lot of fun. I, I really had a, a great time. My family was here, and we just we, we thoroughly enjoyed it. And there's a lot more going on here than, than you might think. Uh, and it, of course, it is really as simple as what you think as well. It, it it's battling and I don't know if not really fighting with art but it's a competition for art so as best as I can explain it um, these people have 20 minutes to create a, a painting they use the same materials same palette and I, I think that they're, they're tools they can use you know the, the knives or scrapers or or, or paintbrushes and they, they create it uh, the, the palettes are all, all kind of pre-selected and the, the how much paint is up to them they, they put on and I'm trying I think I'm trying to show the palettes here so it, it is it, it is extraordinary that this the kind of the depth of which you know how, how they accept the challenge um, because a lot of it is their technique like can they do something quickly that looks decent in, in 20 minutes and that that's really the catch and then some of them practice and some of them are just just go and get inspired and some this just destroys they for lack of a better term they, they fail at it and uh, it, it's not funny but uh, but I'm laughing of course but it, 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 it's just the pressures just I assume get to them and, and it looks like it's just something unfinished. But look at this. That, that painting, if I had a year to make that painting, I couldn't do it. And, and this individual did it in, in 20 minutes. And I'm, again, I'm sure she practices just to get the technique down and be quick at it. And, and it's, 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 uh, it's unbelievable. And we did talk to some of the artists, and this is another one. I can't get my head around how good that is. But we, uh, we talked to the artists, and they said, for, la for lack of a better term as well, the paint was cheap this year. But it, it, it's consistent across the board, so with that in mind, you know, the artist needs to deal with that and, and react to it. And I don't think we just have a photo of one. The announcer, her job was to keep everything lively, so I can't really fault her. That's a tough job. So yeah, using the using the the, the medium as as well as they could, but uh, nice use of color there. A lot of blue. I guess you can see that with your own eyes, but yeah. So it it was fun. It, it, we everyone kind of had to move in a circle here, and she keeps saying tornado. So you keep walking around and around. And this horse brings up a, a good point too. Is uh, you need to play to the audience, and I don't know. We, we live in Western Canada, and the Western motif is popular here. So, drawing a horse is uh, is a good way to get people, the audience, uh, for you. So it, it's it, it's it's that technique as well, or that you know that is part of the competition. Is what will the audience think is good? You know, th that's a cool picture, and will p but will people vote just a bunch of, you know, the streaks on the, p on the canvas? So, it's it's really impressing your audience. So, a, a lot of depth to this competition. It's very social, and you have your drinks, and you, you talk, and we, we knew people here, and we, it was a good opportunity to visit and discuss things, and, and just in this kind of setting, so... Impressive. We, we move, I move on to round two here. So some new new, uh, new painters. And the 
we vote. He put a, a, a silent vote. A hidden ballot. Majority rules. So uh, the, the, more, the painters with the two two painters with the highest vote move on. Well, that was tough to get that thought out. And then they, and the finals come. And everyone, everyone, uh, four people go in the finals. And the one, one wins. Isn't that neat? But I played the paintings. I I enjoyed this immensely. It's not the first one we've been to. Uh, live music, which will come up shortly, and I'll try to be quiet for that and just let you hear. What's going on? And this is amazing to me. This that is just so amazing. So you you buy your tickets, and then at the end the paintings get auctioned off, and all that money goes to a local charity. And it's a great fundraiser, fun night. And I also wanted to talk a little about just. I don't know, typecasting, and I mean, I'm sure people can look it up, but they know where I live. I do say it in other videos, I live in Canada, and I, live, and I said I live in Western Canada. I don't live in a city, I live in a small town, but I live close to a city. And, uh, you know, I, I, I know what people think, and they think we're hicks, and I'm, I'm sure I'm a hick. But, and they think, you know, they think... Hicks are uncultured, but the moment you typecast someone and pigeonhole them is the moment you find out you're wrong. And it's just amazing how many great artists are in this local small community and how many people love art that they pay money to go watch it. And I was astounded the first time I saw, I went to this art battle, just how many people are interested. And the mix of people, there's lots of young kids and there's a fair bit of youth there as well. And old people like me and, as you can see, seniors. And it is, it's a real mix of people that are just, you know, that interested in art. And it's not that we don't have anything else to do because there's the internet. So it, it's, it was really neat to see that and, and just the great support for art there is. And I'm sure in your community as well. Here's the man. Woman. Tornado keeps moving. All right. Oh. Keep moving. Lovely job. It's hard though, isn't it? We have a lovely, it looks like a, a friendly raven, maybe. They played the two, two and a half hours straight, just little songs and things like that. And I, I, it was a nice, it provided a nice atmosphere, and I really appreciated it. And, and these, these are the finalists. My daughter bought that picture there. She, she really likes it. The artist was happy with this. So. This is the picture that won uh, the young lady the competition. And kind of touching, she said it was a picture of her mother. It's quite good. I have no complaints, considering you know, the constraints. She was working with. Neat bear there as well. Really good. And even this bird is not necessarily my taste, but I thought it was exceptional. It was painted in 20 minutes. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll keep you up to date.